is this is a, a massive step forwards. Let's take a look back at the goals, Adam, and what a start for Austria. I thought Germany were very, very poor in the first 20 minutes, and of course that was a poor cross there from Wiener, but certainly a foul there. Velen Reuter giving it away, and the captain, Grinigrich, tucks it away nicely into the top corner, and at that stage I really felt that Austria certainly deserved it the way that they started, but the way that Germany did come back, I think the goal really kicked them into gear, and this was a wonderful goal, wasn't it, from Max Meyer. You can't allow him to turn inside on his right foot and be given that amount of time. Just that little run away from Selka just creates that little bit of space for him to bend it past Daniel Bachmann into the top corner. And that was just at a key stage of the game, wasn't it? Just coming into half time. Austria needed that half time whistle to come. They didn't get it. And they've really defended set plays very, very badly all game. And this was another reason. Captain Goretzka. With a free header, he just lost Philip Leinhardt in the centre half. Allowed to have the free header. And once they went 2 1 up, Wayne, I just felt they were in complete control. And I was always going to go on and get a few more. And get a few more. They did. Akpaguma's ball in. Selka. That really was the match winning dagger through the heart, wasn't it, from Selka? Just four minutes into the second half. The worst possible start to the second period yeah it was it really really was Lazardo the seven just come inside a little bit too much we created the space and Kimmich and Sané into space very clever finish from Sané having just missed what was a, a wonderful run just moments earlier they say sometimes if you don't strike it sweetly it actually ends up in the back of the net and he beats back when it is near post and then Germany were in complete control. They got a little bit sloppy towards the end. They weren't really keeping the ball well enough. And the first time that Austria put any pressure on them. And that was a wonderful finish from Gregorich, the captain. It was good pressure there from Schoft on Tart. But never did that enough in the second half. And the captain, Gregorich, pretty much the, the only bright spot of the evening. For Austria, he keeps up his record of scoring in every game. That is five successive games now.